Good afternoon and welcome to the latest edition of the Marry With Children documentary, The Girls of Marry With Children. As we look back on the 11 seasons of the iconic uh, TV franchise, uh, Marry With Children, which dawned throughout the USA on Fox uh, Network throughout the 80s and throughout the 90s. Uh, this week's edition, we go to uh, we go to the episode of Frat Chance. Uh, which aired on October 25, 1992. And our guest actress this evening is the one and only Lindy Hudis. Uh, Lindy, I suppose Marry With Children, such an iconic uh, show. Uh, tell me, in terms of the nostalgia surrounding it, how important for you in terms of uh, your career uh, was it to be involved in such a franchise? Well, it was always fun being the... Uh, married with children, babe, I guess you could say. Um, to be honest, that was my first job in Hollywood. I had studied acting in New York at NYU, and then I moved to LA in January of 1992 to pursue a film and television career. And Married with Children was my first Hollywood job. And I was just really excited about being there. We worked on the show for a week. Everyone was so nice. Everybody was just great. And it was just a really fun experience being part of that show. And I couldn't really even believe that I had to pinch myself that I'm really in Hollywood and I'm on the set of Married with Children. And it was a fun experience. And I suppose, uh, Lindy, had you watched a few seasons of the show air, uh, earlier on when it was on uh, TV? Were you a fan of the sitcom in terms of uh, watching uh, the previous sorts of seasons? Were you aware of, of Married with Children uh, before you got the gig? Yes, I was. Like I said, I was living in New York at the time, uh, studying acting in New York when the show basically started becoming popular. And I remember everybody was talking about it. Oh my gosh, my battery is running low. Honey, can you plug this in for me, please? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, sweetie. I got to plug my battery in. Um, so yes, I remember people talking about it. So I turned on to the TV show to find out, you know, what the excitement was about the show and it was really funny i just thought it was so funny <laughs> there goes the video <laughs> yeah, it's okay. yeah lindy just press the same button again and it should pop back up okay is the is the okay sorry i am Perfect. so sorry You're about this again, yeah. no problem you were saying <laughs> so there we go you were saying lindy and I um, I was saying yeah. that yeah, far away. I turned on to um, Married with Children because I heard people talking about this really funny show. And at the time, the Fox Network was very new. And they had um, like the Tracy Ullman show and The Simpsons. And my roommate in New York at the time turned me on to the Fox Network. And I remember one night just watching this show, Married with Children. And I thought Ed O'Neill, who you know played the father, was so funny and so full of life. And it was just such a real show. It was not polished and pretty and it was just so funny and I thought Christina Applegate was like the most gorgeous woman so yeah I was a big fan of the show and I suppose uh, Lindy uh, when you got sort of cast in the role uh, you were probably a young actress as you mentioned at the time in, in terms of speaking to family and uh, loved ones and what was your sort of general uh, reaction to you getting a role in Marry with Children? Well, I'm from a small town. I grew up in Germantown, Tennessee, which is just a little hick town in the middle of nowhere. And I made the paper. I made the local paper. And um, in the paper, it said, local girl is on Married with Children in Hollywood. And my parents said, oh, the redheaded lady is so funny. And so yeah, they were pretty proud, my parents, because it made the local hometown paper, hometown girl, gone good so it was an interesting yeah and i suppose that uh, lindy when you arrived on set uh, in terms of marry with children speaking to a number of actresses so far they tell me they in encountered a five-star experience in terms of how they were treated in terms of makeup in terms of wardrobe in terms of getting their own sort of dressing room in terms of being fed and even for a guest star for one episode they were treated like a main sort of cast member was that the sort of ex same experience for yourself 
Yeah, it, it was. They were all very nice. Um, I, I was wearing like a, a pink dress and pink shoes and they totally dressed me in pink and each one of the girls was wearing a different color. And um, they gave me these huge pink earrings that were like these big, huge balls. And um, we had a really beautiful dressing room, very spacious for all of us girls. And they were really cool. They were really professional, very friendly. The crew members, um, if memory serves, it was shot at um, Sunset Gower Studios, okay. from what I believe in Hollywood. Yeah, and um, I was a bit intimidated driving up to the gate because there's a guard there and they have to open the gate. And, and I'm like, hi, I'm working on Married with Children today. And the guard said, okay, come in and just open the gate and gave me a parking pass. And I was just walking around the lot going, oh, wow, I can't believe I'm really here. So it was um, a surreal experience. And I suppose, uh, Lindy, in terms of the episode, as we know, it's all about it's centered around uh, Bud's character setting up yeah. a, a fraternity for his sort of geeky sort of uh, friends in the hope to get uh, college girls. And uh, I suppose uh, Bud, uh, in terms of one by one, his college friends uh, start, start dropping out. And uh, when he does land the girls uh, yourselves, uh, he, he tells them a rotten lie about him being... Uh, into the let's say being into the same sex uh in yes. terms of uh stuff like that and uh yes. obviously he tricks his own father and uh jefferson because obviously the girls want someone to dance with and uh the al and uh jefferson are thinking that they're score dancing and making out with uh three college girls who in fact uh, think they're uh, the al and uh jefferson are an item as such so uh in terms of that sort of shooting in the shed, uh, what what you remember of that sort of set in terms of arriving and uh, the whole dance scenes with uh, Jefferson, uh, Ted McGinley and uh, Ed O'Neill? And were you in conversation with Ed O'Neill and Ted McGinley and what did they say to you? Oh, you yeah, remember? they were great. They, um, they introduced themselves, were very friendly. It was a fun scene to shoot because we got to dance and we got to have a lot of fun. There was also a lot of downtime when we would just kind of sit around. But um, Ted McGinley and Ed O'Neill were wonderful. They were just so wonderful and so friendly. And, um, yeah, I, I didn't get any vibe from them at all that they were too good or they, they didn't act like you know, stars at all. They were just down to earth, really nice guys. And it was a fun scene to shoot because we all danced together. Mm. And I suppose, uh, Lindy, uh, in terms of uh, Marry with Children, uh, when the show aired on October the 25th, 1992, can you remember what you were doing at the time? Were you at home with family and friends or loved ones? Were you acting? Or do you remember actually seeing it for the first time? Did you see the premiere or was it afterwards, a few years later that you saw it for the first time? I was at home recording it. <laughs> I was at my apartment in Hollywood recording it. So I would have it for posterity reasons. And my, my parents were at home watching it and my friends and family were at home watching it and they recorded it as well. Yeah. And I suppose, uh, Lindy, in terms of married with children, uh, I see there you have a young daughter and you probably have uh, more sort of family members. Uh, what's it like uh, when they hear their, your, their, their mother was in married with children, such an iconic sort of a TV show, which relevant to such a younger generation that even to this day, people turn on married with children and watch it and still find it funny. Is it one of those <laughs> jobs in your career that, uh, let's say, your daughter and such and such are proud of their mother for appearing in married with children is definitely one when they look down the resume they start to pick it out straight away to be honest they don't know what it is um i both of my kids because my husband was a was an actor and a stuntman for years and we tried getting our kids into acting um they had an agent for a while and they went on auditions but they just weren't that interested in it and um like my son he's 13 and i talked to him about being on married with children and he's like oh okay you know and my daughter is like oh okay that's cool because it was so before their time and they yeah. so didn't know what it was and they're they just aren't impressed. <laughs> they just aren't impressed at all. So, but that's okay. You know, that's okay. I still have the memories and the experience. And uh, Lindy, in terms of married with children, I suppose it was the start for numerous actresses got their gig in terms of uh, married with children from the likes of yeah. Denise Richards uh, to Tiffany mm -hmm. Thiessen, 
uh, Pamela Anderson, uh, they've all done a stunt in Married with Children in terms of starting off. And uh, in terms of some of the actresses, numerous sort of actresses that have gone through Married with Children throughout the years, gone through, uh, gone on to successful, really successful careers. It really gave uh, an opportunity to young actresses. Then it, it was a sort of show where it sort of opened up a doors. Because once you had Married with Children on your CV in terms of credits or something like that, uh, all of a sudden, other directors, producers were in, interested, I suppose, in, in, in terms of speaking to you, I imagine. Well, I uh, did some acting. Um, like I said, I had a small part in um, Indecent Proposal, mm -hmm. and I did some theater. I had a small part on Beverly Hills 90210. This was all the early 90s. Mm -hmm. And... Um, then I've, I've turned my focus on to writing. I, have, I haven't acted in years, and I've turned my focus to writing. And um, as a matter of fact, I've written a book about my years as an actress in Hollywood. I have written okay. a book that was inspired by that. Okay. And I suppose, uh, Lindy, in terms of Mary with Children, at the time in the early 90s and 80s, there was some controversy in terms of the show being a bit out there and sort of a portrayal of the modern sort of family. I suppose there were an awful lot of Christians and Catholics uh, were very staunch against this sort of chauvinism or sexism or this sort of mm -hmm. really sort of testosterone driven show geared at sort of the 16 to 35 year old sort of male sort of audience but it was really a sort of light humored sort of show and with sort of comedy is that where you angle you saw it from did you see it for the humor and uh, the storylines and the one-liners in terms of or did you have any did you see it in, can you see both sides of the the, the coin well, it was a different time. It was the early 90s, and I did not have a problem with the sexy girls and the jokes, and it was it was just a funny, lighthearted farce. It was a sexy mm -hmm. farce showing um, the American family, and yeah, it had some elements to it that might have been some people, but I didn't find it offensive at all. I thought it was just funny and fun and lighthearted. And today, would a show like Married with Children get produced today in this political climate? Who knows? I don't know. Mm -hmm. But back then, it was a different time. And I had a good time. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed the show. I had fun. And I suppose, uh, Lindy, uh, lastly, if you could summarize in two sentences your time in uh, Marry with Children and what that experience was like for you as a young actress, uh, what would you like to say? First acting job in Hollywood. Um, big, wide-eyed, small-town girl on a set of a very popular TV show. Uh, it was um, something that was meant to be, and it was excitement. Uh, on that note, uh, Lindy Yudas, uh, an absolute pleasure talking to you today to relive your memories of uh, and Marry with Children, playing the episode, uh, one of the dancers in Frat Chance, the episode Frat Chance, Frat Chance which mm -hmm. aired across uh, the United States on October the 25th, 1992. And I suppose for you, mm -hmm. Lindy, uh, your legacy in Marry with Children will always go on. The show is currently being streamed all over the world and shown in numerous TV stations from Ireland, France, England. And uh, mm -hmm. South America dubbed in so many languages. So even to this day, people are experiencing you and your role in Marry with Children. So for that, you're part of the fraternity of the girls of Marry with uh, Children. We are one of the girls that appeared in the 11 uh, seasons. It's an exclusive uh, sort of VIP sort of list. Uh, we uh, thank you for sharing uh, your memories with us this evening and we wish you a prosperous 2021. Thank you very much. Thank you for having me. No problem, Lindy. And I apologize profusely for any of the <laughs> technical problems that we had. <laughs> no problem. Take care. All right.